It's been three days since 30-year-old Yamisha Thomas was reported missing. But even though Yamisha seemed happy with wealthy boyfriend Sylvester Davis, investigators have recently learned that Yamisha was still legally married to a man named Ricky Thompson. And she had recently begun seeing a soldier by the name of Rashad Maddox. Yamisha has her current boyfriend, Sylvester. She has her husband with whom she's not involved, but is still extremely angry about what has transpired in their relationship. And she is carrying on relationships with other men romantically. On April 26, 2011, authorities questioned Rashad Maddox about his involvement with Yamisha. When was the last time you saw Yamisha? The Saturday before Easter. You do realize you're the last individual to see her before her disappearance? Yes. Rashad also admits that the two T-shirts found in the backseat of Yamisha's truck belonged to him. It could have belonged to the perpetrator during the commission of the crime. Tell us the truth. Did anything happen between you that night? No. What were the shirts doing in the truck? I guess I just forgot them. He said he's innocent. He had no involvement in Yamisha's death. She was supposed to have been going out with her girlfriends, but said she decided to go out with me. You know, we went out and hung out and had a good time. But when detectives pressed Rashad for more details, he mentioned something bizarre. She kept getting text messages and phone calls from somebody. The whole time that night they were out together, her cell phone was ringing. Every time a text message would pop up, the initials SD would show up. Police assumed the initials SD must belong to Yamisha's other boyfriend, Sylvester Davis. They were still dating and we're in a relationship. He definitely kept tabs on Yamisha. But Rashad claims that at one point during their date, he saw a text on Yamisha's phone that read, I see you. 